Yo, what is up you guys? Welcome back to another video and for today's video guys, we have absolutely just crazy Roblox news to get to today. Like how a lot of people that played the Roblox The Hunt is getting mad. Like this The Hunt event was an absolute disappointment. And there's a singer called Zara that just was spotted playing The Hunt and I believe she was the one that cussed when she was performing. Uh, and this Roblox item is going for 36,000 Robux and is leaving so many people very angry. But before we start this video guys, I'm about to ask if you guys can subscribe and like today's video if you want to support my channel and you want to see more videos from me make sure to subscribe and like today's video but anyways let's get on to today's video so the first thing i do want to go over for today is how a lot of people that played the hunt is getting mad like a lot of people are saying that this hunt was very mid and that these quests and badges are just very unnecessary like a lot of these games that the developers were making for the hunt was just absolutely trash uh so as you can see here from chiseled uh one of the roblox's most biggest commentary youtubers out there the hunt's kind of mid uh, a lot of people also saying the same thing like Schlepp, he basically says the same thing on why the hunt is mid. And I'm not going to lie guys, I have to agree because I've been I've been seeing a lot of feedback from a lot of different people on Twitter and seeing the reason why people don't like this hunt and it's because a lot of these developers that participated in this hunt didn't even try. Like some of these games didn't like were just like to get the badge all you had to do was stay in the game for 15 minutes. Like there was no quest. The quest was basically just stay AFK for 15 minutes and you get a badge. Like that is the most lazy way to develop for the hunt like i'm so sorry why even participate the hunt if that's what you're just going to do and it just made me think like a lot of these developers just participated in the hunt just to get a free promotion basically out of their game just to get just to farm players into their game a lot of people in my last video basically commented saying the same thing like how a lot of these developers didn't even try the quest was basically just play their game and that's about it and you get the badge like a lot of games also did very well don't get me wrong like the wars and arsenal they did a fantastic job but also a lot of developers didn't even try like pet sim 99 as well reach area 20 to get the hunt badge i'm sorry a lot of people play pet sim 99 and they have already reached like area 20 years ago so this was like the easiest like like the easiest quest ever like that's why a lot of people are upset because it was either it's too, the, the quests were too easy like you could beat these quests in like two minutes or you didn't even have to try you just join the game and you get the badge like that, that's no fun like what's the point of participating if that's what you guys are going to be doing like of course a lot of people are upset but some people are very upset like for example the developer for the obby but on a bike is receiving death threats like this developer is receiving death threats uh, as you can see here in uh this tweet from Binzi, i don't care if it's the scummiest most annoying quest ever given you never ever have the excuse to send death threats to developers period and in this case bike of hell was actually a pretty fun and easy quest i'm genuinely disgusted with some people in the community and as you can see here from mousy uh he was the developer for bike of hell uh she got a lot of death threats i know some of you guys don't like that bike of hell is in the hunt and i think that is fine to not like it and whatnot i get it what's not okay is sending us death threats and telling the devs to die and that we should get cancer just because you hate our game telling us that it's the worst game made and that it shouldn't be in the hunt uh so yeah this is absolutely disgusting whoever was sending death threats to these developers you do not deserve to be on the internet okay you don't deserve to be on roblox or the internet itself you should not be sending death threats to people just because you can't beat the quest or if the quest was too easy you get you have no rights no like no right at all to send death threats to people over that like that is the most stupid way like you can actually if if this developer wanted to press charges like you could actually go to jail because I, like you can't just be doing that bro like it's over a freaking roblox game you're threatening to kill people over a roblox game and how they should get cancer like come on man that's that's, that's just absolutely disgusting but yeah a lot of people are getting mad at developers that participated in the hunts but getting death threats is a absolute no-go like of course you can get mad at these developers like hey you, you didn't even try this was a lazy attempt like what the hell but you can't give people death threats that's when you go just way too freaking far for no reason but yeah anyways uh let me know down below in the comments on your guys is about the hunt like have you enjoyed playing the hunt uh let me know down below on your feedback i would love to hear your guys's opinions 
But anyways, let's get on to our next news for today. And that is the singer Zara was spotted playing the hunt. Uh, if you guys know who Zara is, she's a very popular singer. And I believe she part I, I believe she performed on Roblox once. I don't know if I'm mixing these people up, but I believe she was the one that cussed <laughs> on Roblox. Like she was saying the F word yeah. or something. I'm not sure if this is the lady, but I don't know. Zara seems the name Zara on Roblox seems very familiar. I think she's the one that cussed on Roblox. But yeah, we saw her on the hunt, uh, so that's pretty cool, I guess. But anyways, let's get on to our last and final Roblox news for today. And and this is ridiculous from Roblox. And that is how they're making one of the hunt items on Roblox. 36,000 Robux. Like, who the hell is going to be buying this? As you can see here from RTC, the second limited time exclusive item for the hunt launches at the very cheap price of 36,000 Robux. And this got a lot of people pissed because who the hell can afford this okay no kid on roblox can afford this item like thirty six thousand robux is equivalent to almost three hundred dollars like no kid has three hundred dollars to spend on swords like come on roblox be realistic with your prices i even posted a community post about it like two weeks ago saying how the golden clockwork headphones was way overpriced and that roblox needs to be more realistic with the prices this is a great example okay like ten thousand robux was already like too much but you're putting it up to thirty six thousand for a sword pack like come on roblox like like i don't know if they're doing this by purpose or if they're just this incompetent with how the players are but no player on roblox okay like 99 percent of the players can't afford this okay please roblox be realistic with your prices like just for once and as you can see from clarification, this item is not and will not be a limited item for users to re resell or trade. Roblox has updated the label and the hub to say limited time offer instead of just limited, so suggesting as such. So I guess people were thinking like this item was a limited item because Roblox just put in the description saying limited item. And many people think this was a limited item. But instead, it actually meant they actually meant that this item was going to be for a limited time only. So if a certain date comes, this item will no longer be on sale and you cannot resell it or trade it. You, you can't do that because this is only a limited item, uh, which gave a lot of people confusion. Like, hey, limited item, that means limited item, right? No, it just means limited time only. So, yeah, but still, nobody's going to buy this. Like, I, <laughs> I just don't see a reason. But anyways, you guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you have enjoyed this video today, make sure to slap that like button and that red sub button to support me and my channel. Make sure to join my Discord server down below in the description below. But anyways, you guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. Make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell if you have enjoyed this video. Let us know in the comments below what you would like to see next.